Hey y'all, today we're gonna do some socialization. At Home Depot, I got my big boy, Ozzy. Hi, Papa. So, so yeah, we're, uh, we, I like to take them out with me whenever I run errands to a place that allows dogs. Definitely Home Depot, Lowe's, the pet stores, most pet stores do allow them. So I got a lot of yard work I gotta do today. I'm gonna, um, trim the trees like that one right there that have that had fallen from the uh from the ice and try and put some of the uh, fungicide on the cut surface i need to get a i need to get a um a saw a saw or a chainsaw probably get a chainsaw this my papa but yeah so um We'll be on our way and I'll film uh, how uh, how he does in Home Depot. Ozzy, as, as many of y'all know, um, I had to do a lot of work with him because he used to be dog aggressive. And so um, I worked with him and was able to um, correct that behavior. So now he'll see, if he sees a dog, he's not gonna like it, but uh, he's not gonna lunge at it and, and try to attack it. So I'll show you all that, and maybe we'll see a dog in Home Depot, and I'll show you how he reacts. Um, for all of you commenters out there that say, no, you shouldn't be taking him in public without a muzzle, uh, that may be true for some dogs, but, but not this one. I know this one. This one's been trained and very well socialized with people. So he's, he's no threat to people that don't pose a threat to me. Um, so you'll see that. You'll see that in Home Depot, how he reacts to people. Yes, that's my papa. Come on, us. So we, we'll see you in a little bit. <laughs> okay, we're here at Home Depot. Ozzy's gotta mark some trees first. shopping? Let's go shopping. We need to get some mulch. Let's see how he's by my side. I don't let him pull me. And if he tries to get in front of me, he gets a correction. So. It's a, it's a, it's a mastiff. Hey! He likes you. It looks like, you. like, like a purple. Did y'all cut his ears? Okay. Did y'all cut his yeah. ears? Yeah. Yes. Oh Hi. yeah, Ma, he looks Hi. exactly like Cody because my dad, he has a pit bull and he cuts his ears oh. and he looks exactly like that, except oh, gray and bull. white. Oh. oh no, he's so cute. Y'all have a pit bull? Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. He's so cute. He's kind of sweet. The reason that I cut mine is because I have three of them and they yank on the ears yeah. and they, they get rid. Yeah. Ours gets like a lot of ear infections now. Yeah. 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 I love big dogs. Yes, me too. Say thank you. Thank you. Hi. You're welcome. Thank you. Yeah. And a good, a good um, thing that you can do is when you're walking, just quickly change directions, and then they're forced to to follow you. Let's see, Papa. See. If I can do it here, as you go this way, you just kind of like do a 180. So, yeah, that's good. And he should stay right behind you, never in front of you. Good boy, Papa. Okay, as you sit. Sit down. There you go. Good thing. Where is he? Okay. Come. This is good training. Good boy, Papa. Say good boy. <laughs> Is that a French master? Uh, no, he's an Italian. 
kind of course so italian master wow yeah he's friendly beautiful dog say hi papa you smell rufus don't you oh what do you have i have an english master oh okay how, how much does yours weigh uh, you want to like, say 200 yeah about that okay yeah he's 155 the english mastiffs are bigger aren't they they're taller yeah so he's taller. they're but he's got a bigger head than, this one has than yours or well i don't know he's got his ears clipped maybe yeah, oh, yeah okay. they're about the same size it's got a bigger jowl though yeah boy yeah yeah <laughs> oh wow because when when that one goes we were looking at another dog but oh. man, that's a beautiful dog yeah I, that's an italian huh? oh yeah, yeah italian mastiff kind of course so they're just wonderful i'll never get another breed really i love them let me ask you this yeah. shetty not very much at all like pit bulls Really? Because you know, the, the coat is very short. Yeah. Is your English no, my Mastiff sheds like it's winter all day. Really? He's horrible yeah. at shedding. No. So this one doesn't shed. I mean, they shed, but not at all like other dogs. Oh, no, he can shake his body and it just looks like snow Oh, flurries. no, 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 not like that. What you're saying, I also heard that about uh, Dogo Argentinos. Uh -huh. They say they shed a lot too because I almost got a Dogo. But no, I, I, this is totally manageable. What I do is I just have my little Roomba. You know, the, the room Yeah, well, if we got one of those now, yeah. but it, it still don't stop from shedding. Because she'll go out there, my wife will go out there and brush oh, them. Oh, yeah. And it's just filled yeah, okay. every single day she goes out there and brush they, them. What they, they do, they, you know, quote, they blow their coat like once or twice a year. Yeah. Where they'll shed a little bit more, but honestly, no. No, he sheds a lot. That's why, that's one of the things. He sheds worse than a German Shepherd. We have German oh Shepherds. My God. Yeah, yeah, he shows like a German Shepherd. Well, do you, do you, do you bathe them too much or something? No, we don't bathe them at all. Oh, okay, yeah. So That's crazy. very, very seldom do we bathe them. Is that characteristic of that breed? Or? I don't know. I didn't think so. I, I, we didn't, we didn't think so because they're such a short breed right, dog, right. A short haired dog. Unless it's something in their diet, like you know, maybe they need some like fish oil. Yeah, we'll have to look into it, man, because yeah, that's the thing that drives us up the wall. Fish oil or something, you know, or, or something like that. Okay. But anyway, yeah, no, they don't shed hardly any. Oh, okay. Right. Yeah, because the shits has got long hair and you'll never shed. Yeah. I mean, he sheds yeah. more hair than the dog. You can probably feel a dog. Yeah, there. yeah. Okay. That's a beautiful dog. Thank you. You have a good day. All right, you too. Thanks. Okay. Let's go. Let's get this. Let's get this. Good boy. Yeah, it's a good boy. Okay, boys. Let's go see. Good boy. Go back. Go back now. That's a kill. This is This He's trying to decide what to plant for his vegetable garden. What you gonna plant in your vegetable garden? Isaac, what you gonna plant this year? What you gonna plant this year? Come on.
very good. Let's go pee pee. So yeah, I like to, like I said, like at least you know, a couple times a month or whenever I'm out, I like to um, take them with me. As you can see uh, in the beginning of the video, how um, the little, the little, uh, the kids were petting on them. Then that's great, great, great exposure great socialization just gotta go get all the poles all the trees okay go pee pee I wanna claim this one I wanna claim that one gotta get the other side now get the other side just to make sure there's no misunderstanding who owns that pole <laughs> dogs are so funny okay bye bye let's go all right well yeah so hope y'all enjoyed that um yeah i think it went really well he was able to uh interact with some kids which is great always nice when they can get that socialization in um and uh yeah so thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe and check me out on my tiktok as well and uh, we will see y'all uh, on the next one bye y'all Is that your moat? <laughs> Is that a good bit? Is that a good bit? Is that a good bit? So we got our mulch. Hi, Papa. Hi, Papa. See you.